Uh, maybe today's biggest story of the game, the fans are returning to American Family Field. CBS 58's Rose Schmidt talking to him and has this. Hey, Rose. Coming back here to watch the Brewers brought out all sorts of emotions today. The consensus is fans tell us they are glad to be able to watch the game from the seats instead of from their couch. But the vibe feels a bit different. It may have a new name. So I got to be honest, I, I still call it Miller Park. But it's the same game that fans know and love. Oh, I knew I was never going to miss it unless I absolutely had to. And for many, Thursday was an emotional return to American Family Field. Go Brewers. I go to 40 games a year and I really tremendously missed it. So some days I would just come here and look at the stadium and have tears in my eyes. It feels like we're getting back to normal. I'm a season ticket holder. I really missed baseball last year and I'm glad to be back. The Brewers can have 25% capacity under a plan approved by the Milwaukee Health Department. 12,000 fans allowed on opening day against the Twins. This is my 52nd consecutive opening day. I was at opening day since the very first one in 1970. But this year isn't just any other year. Masks are required and tailgating is not allowed. I mean, it's so much fun, you know, grill out and have a drink and, you know, good time. So, yeah, it, you know, I miss that big time. Fans tell us they look forward to the day when they're able to grill again and the seats are full. But for now, they'll take this. After sitting in quarantine all the time and, you know, just nice to be back at a live sporting event. The team hopes to expand capacity once it gets approval from the health department. Those conversations are ongoing and they will continue throughout the rest of the season. Reporting live from American Family Field, Rose Schmidt, CBS 58 News.